everyone press the bell icon on the youtube app and never miss any update from iwm buzz Shweta, how are you? Hi, I'm good. How are you? Hi, everyone. What's happening? Where are you busy these days? I am busy with uh, a film that I've just finished, which is called The Tashkent Files, and that's about the mysterious death of Lal Bahadur Shastri ji. It's directed by Mr. Vivek Agnihotri. So, the shoot is complete, and uh, next week I'm off to Indonesia because there's so many fans in Indonesia of Chandra Nandini. So, I want to meet them all again. So I'm busy with that and um, a short film complete care. So just a couple of those things. Okay. So tell us something about your movie. How like just now you can speak. Oh uh, well, I'm playing a journalist and it's really cool because uh, I am a journalist by qualification. Mm-hmm. I have my graduation mass media and journalism in mm-hmm. Kerala. So it's really cool that way. And the film is about Lal Bahadur Shastri and his um, you know mysterious death. Mm-hmm. And the film has Mr. Nasiruddin Shah and it's got Mr. Mithun Chakraborty. तो दोनों के साथ मैंने पहले काम किया हुआ है मिठुन जी के साथ भी ना बिगोली फिल्म एंड नसीर अंकल के साथ एक बाल में एंड शॉट अंदर है डांस सो इट्स रियली नाइस इट्स अ डैम इट्स कॉल्ड अ नाइस ऑन सॉन्ग कास्ट एंड अ वेरी कूल स्टोरी एंड वी हैव डन विद द शूट अभी पोस्ट प्रोडक्शन चल रहा है आई रियली होप एवरीवन लव्स इट इट्स कमिंग आउट समवेयर प्रॉब्ली दिस ईयर ओके सो लॉर्ड ऑफ फैंस वर वेटिंग तो उनके क्वेश्चंस ले लेते हैं सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल अमन भटनागर ही वांट्स टू नो व्हाट हैव यू लर्न फ्रॉम द डायरेक्टर्स दैट यू हैव वर्क टिल नाउ थ्रू आउट योर करियर हाय अमन दैट्स सच अ कूल क्वेश्चन व्हाट हैव आई लर्न फ्रॉम द डायरेक्टर्स हुएवर आई हैव वर्क्ड विद सो फार आई थिंक ऑल द डायरेक्टर्स हैव अ डिफरेंट स्टाइल एंड यू नो डिफरेंट वे ऑफ टेकिंग एंड यू नो डिफरेंट वे ऑफ अप्रोच सम डायरेक्टर्स यू नो डिफरेंट टेम्परामेंट्स सो हर डायरेक्टर के साथ एक अलग एक्सपीरियंस होता है दे कम विद देयर ओन नॉलेज देयर ओन एक्सपीरियंसेस इन लाइफ बट आई थिंक द ओनली कांस्टेंट थिंग इन ऑल डायरेक्टर्स इज पेशेंस दे आर सो पेशेंट वो प्रोडक्शन का एक्टर्स का लोकेशन का आर्ट डायरेक्शन का ये पेंट वो पेंट वो लाइटिंग सब कुछ सब कुछ करते हैं एंड दे जस्ट हैव वन थिंग इन माइंड दैट ओके इवेंचुअली ये प्रोडक्ट रेडी करना है out in front of the audience and all they think is what are you guys thinking what is the audience thinking so i think i think that's that's such a you know it's it's more mind work you know it's so much more mind work okay a fan of yours pooja malikar is asking how would you describe your journey so far in the industry oh hi pooja my journey so far in the industry has been really cool i can call myself an outsider who grew up in the industry you know i've had so many friends from the industry people from the film families and uh, assistant directors and directors have been my friends but uh, so far i think the industry has been very very welcoming and one thing i know is that uh, the industry appreciates um, you know people who are talented people who are hard working and they give you work and uh, it's a lovely place to be trust me the industry is my extended family and they uh, i'm quite spoiled <laughs> okay Niharika Shrivastava has a message for you she says hi the i love your acting and your work very much thank you Niharika okay Ren- Ranili Mukherjee has a message hi my dear meri pyari Shweta Basu kaisi hai aap uh, remember me i am so happy to get information that you will come back to jakarta oh, indonesia yes. very nice to talk to you da- during in jakarta keep hum- humble Thank you so much. Yes, I look forward to meeting all my fans in Jakarta. I'm going next week, and I can't wait for it. And uh, see you all. See you all very, very soon. Okay, Radhika wants to know what's your favorite color. What's my favorite color? I love pastels. So I don't have one particular color. I think all colors are so beautiful, so beautiful. You can like any color. But personally, I love pastels. You know, light pink, <laughs> light blue, mint green. येलो वाइट उस शेड में जितने कलर्स हैं मुझे बहुत लोग उसको फीके कलर्स बुलाते हैं बट आई लव पेस्ट आई थिंक दे लुक सो नाइस स्पेशली ड्यूरिंग समर्स आई थिंक दीज आर द बेस्ट कलर्स Okay, Jasmeet Kaur, your fan is asking that what have you learned from your character Chandra Nandini? Oh, amazing. Okay, thank you. Oh, sorry, what's her name? Jasmeet. Just need hi just need thank you so much for the question uh whatever i learned from nandini chandra nandini i 
मैंने ये सीखा है कि वो रोती बहुत है और लाइफ में कभी रोना नहीं चाहिए अगर आपको इन्फॉर्मेशन आए अगर आपकी लाइफ में हेलना और अपामा जैसे लोग हो तो उनके बारे में जाके चंद्र को बता देना चाहिए और अपने मन में नहीं रखना चाहिए आई थिंक दैट्स वॉट आई नॉट फ्रॉम नंदिनी जो सब पढ़ आई थिंक शी इज सो इंटेलिजेंट नंदिनी यू नो वॉज अ प्रिंसेस एंड शी वॉज अ ग्रेट डॉटर बहुत अच्छी सहेली थी एंड अ ग्रेट वाइफ इवेंचुअली यू नो टूवर्ड्स द एंड ऑफ द शो शी वॉज ऑल्सो शोन एज अ वेरी गुड मदर सो आई थिंक नंदिनी वॉज द मिक्स ऑफ एवरी इंडियन गर्ल आई थिंक एवरी इंडियन गर्ल इज अ मिक्स ऑफ इंटेलिजेंस ब्यूटी एंड वॉज अ वेरी गुड डॉटर वॉज अ वेरी गुड सिस्टर एंड अ वेरी गुड वाइफ आई थिंक ऑल ऑफ अस एज इंडियन गर्ल्स हैव दैट क्वालिटी इन अस एंड आई थिंक नंदिनी रिप्रेजेंट्स दैट बट रियली मन में बात मत रखो अगर अपामा और हेलना परेशान करी तो जाके चंद्र को बना दो मैं बहुत पछता होगी कितने खाई वाई से फेंक दे तो फिर देख ले ओके योर फैन पेज इज आस्किंग दैट व्हाट वाज योर रिएक्शन व्हेन यू गॉट टू नो दैट इंडोनेशिया लव्स यू सो मच ओ माय गॉड इट वाज सो ओवरवेलमिंग बिकॉज़ यू नो यू आई मीन आई हैव वर्क्ड अ लॉट इन इंडिया सिंस आई वाज अ किड मतलब मकड़ी हुआ या एक बार हुआ कहानी घर घर की हुई या चंद्र नंदिनी बद्रीनाथ की जो रानी आई नो दैट आई हैव अ फैन बेस इन इंडिया ओ इंडियंस अब्रॉड बट एन एंटायर कंट्री लव्स यू यू नो एंड दे डोंट इवन नो योर कल्चर दे डोंट and they just love you because they believe in that character that is so overwhelming and i'm really really humbled and i love all my indonesians fan along with all my indian fans i keep receiving a lot of messages from sri lanka and bangladesh and dubai as well thank you so much you have no idea how much in it, it encourages me mai kabhi bhi usually i don't check comments or i don't read all those things mai post karti hu aur phir mai apni instagram ka app delete kar deti hu and then mujhe post karna hota to app download karke fir karti hu because uh, then i'm on instagram all the time so i don't check comments but once in a while when i do i see so much love and it just you know it's so encouraging you have no idea it just makes me work harder and you know love you guys so much thank you okay miranti a fan of yours she's asking what's your hobby what's my hobby um i love uh, reading i love cooking and i love driving Okay, Pooja is saying that nice to talk to you. I met you on Chandran Nandini set, Shweta. Do you remember? Hi, Pooja. Uh, honestly, I don't remember. I'm so sorry. Maybe if I see your face, yeah. please DM me. Or आप मुझे Instagram या Facebook या Twitter पे मुझे please message कीजिए. मैं आपके profile में जाके I'll see your profile and maybe then I'll be able to recollect. But uh, thank you so much for coming on set and meeting me. Thank you so much for being part of the live chat. Okay, Nita is saying that what kind of acting roles are you looking forward after Chandra Nandini? Oh uh, well, honestly, I love all mediums. Not only TV or films. I you know, I have done TV and mm-hmm. films, I have done short films, I have done web series. Bhi kar rahi so I think today it doesn't really yeah. matter that you are working in which medium. Everybody is exploring every medium. You know, so many stars, uh, proper Bollywood stars are reality show judges. Anil Kapoor is on, you know, twenty four. And you know there's so many television actors who are doing TV, so I think there's an exchange of you know this thing. So I'm not particular which kind of project, but for me, you know, Makri was double role. Ek baar I had to do sign language. I've done South movies also where it was a different culture and language. And Chandra Nandini was a period drama. Tashkent Files. I'm playing a journalist. So I think it's always interesting where you're exploring something new, and it's challenging. And uh, you know, it should surprise all of you <laughs> as much as it should. So Soumya wants to know, like, when when can they watch the movie? Ah, uh, Tashkent Files. Ah, yeah. uh, right now, अभी तो Soumya, thank you for the question. अभी March में shoot complete हुआ है and अभी post production ही चल रहा है. मुझे खुद नहीं पता. मैं खुद बहुत ज़्यादा desperate हूँ. बहुत ज़्यादा. I'm so impatient. I'm, you have no idea what a fantastic film is going to be. And uh, even I'm looking forward to it. But अभी सब tentative है. Confirm कोई dates नहीं हुए हैं. But जैसे ही होंगे. <laughs> okay Ashmit is asking one thing you love about this industry one thing i love about this industry uh that uh, you know it's it lives like one big family uh you know you look at your fingers they're all different sizes and whether you're a salman khan or you're a nawazuddin or you're a karan patel or you're a um you know nasiruddin shah hmm. everybody is working and everybody when they work honestly when they work passionately and um, most 
honestly when they work honestly it's always appreciated and i think a big chunk of it goes to the audience who always encourage us actors and you know also filmmakers to keep doing good work and that's the best thing about the industry that you know people don't judge you by your religion you know hindus and muslims and christians and mm-hmm. sikh and uh, you, you know it does not matter you're a female you're a male what's your age and what's your family background you are talented you can work that's it i think i think that's the best part of the industry that people are really cool people are very broad minded and people are really forward thinking people are not narrow minded i'm sure a lot of other industries are like that but mai kyunki i can say that mai literally pali badi hu film industry mein so i can i know it it's like that and uh, all people care about is uh, you know uh, and they're always there to help you out i think that's just so nice it's it's literally like your extended family very well said okay so there's a message hi shweta can you mention shweta basu prasad team and say her name she's your biggest fan oh. but due to ba- bad weather can't come online and view her prime my favorite idol life oh. that will really please her please okay shweta basu prasad team is i think uh, her name is sauza i hope i'm pronouncing it right and uh, yeah she follows and she posts all the time <laughs> and i follow her personally so guys check out shweta basu prasad team is a really good page i follow it there are a lot of information jo mujhe bhi nahi pata lekin woh is ladki ko sab pata hai so you can go check it out so yeah so fans for south i hope the weather in maldives is fine she's from maldives some people live in maldives <laughs> and uh, yeah so i hope the weather gets fine and she'll be all right soon Okay, Niharika Shivastava is has a message. She says, "I am very happy to hear that you are so interested in classical music. I had taken a little bit in classical singing, but couldn't continue it. I hope I will be able to learn music like you in future." Thank you. Hi, Niharika. I am so pleased to know that you learn classical music. That you are learning vocals. And uh, yes, I used to learn sitar, and I have made a documentary film about the time visibility of classical music in India, especially amongst youth. It's called. and it's available on Netflix so guys please go watch it and um, uh, yeah because you know aap radio mein hamesha 5 6 7 8 itne sare channels hai but wo wohi panch gaane continuously bajate hain ek english channel hai bechara wo bhi wohi gaane bajata hai you don't have any television channels or you don't have any radio stations where they play classical music and unless there is um, an exhibition of art how will an audience know it maybe people like you niharika or like me or so many people want to explore you know who is pandit ravi shankar you know what is sitar i used to, i used to learn sitar and what you know how beautiful these instruments and these are yours you know maybe rap culture is not yours it is still borrowed but classical music sa re ga ma pa da ni sa aapka hai aur agar aap uska dhyan nahi rakhenge usko preserve nahi karenge how will your kids come to know about it we cannot be the last generation to know about this and we have to preserve it and do something about it in our own way i did it i made roots and thank you niharika that you learned it and i really hope that you continue with your music and all of you out there just do one thing just google in in classical music just go on youtube and just search zakir hussain and el subramaniam and pandit ravi shankar and you will know the magic that I'm Nice. Okay, Manami is saying hi, Shweta Di. Please, can you say something in Bengali for your fans in Kolkata? Oh, I'm in Kolkata. Look, there are only 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 Bhalwashi. I have so many relatives in Calcutta, and uh, I'm in Kolkata. Rashukulla. <laughs> <laughs> Yes. <laughs> okay, Rio has a message. He says that first of all, you're looking very cute, and I want to know how you came into this industry. Thanks, Rio. I know. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, how I came into this industry actually. Um, I was 11 when I did Makri, and it was trust me, it was accidental because I was accompanying my dad for a meeting, and वहाँ पर कुछ बच्चों के auditions चल रहे थे for Vishal Bharadwaj's first film. It was called Barf, which was supposed to be made for Ajay Devgan's production. <laughs> और मैं ऐसे ही वेट कर रही थी मेरे पापा ने मुझे स्कूल से पिकअप करके होता है ना अपनी मीटिंग में गए थे आई वाज जस्ट वेटिंग आई वाज जस्ट कुछ भी कर रही थी और उन्होंने मुझे पूछा हैव यू कम फॉर ऑडिशन एंड मुझे लगा इट्स समथिंग एंड आई जस्ट वेंट इन एंड आई ऑडिशन इट वाज सपोज्ड टू बी सुष्मिता सेंस चाइल्डहुड स्पॉट एंड मैंने ऐसे ही ऑडिशन कर दिया था एंड माय फादर वाज लाइक ओके शी शी वाज बिजी उसने कुछ जस्ट लाइक प्लेइंग अराउंड शी डिड इट सो 
Murph never got made, but Vishal uncle then made Makri, and I was because of my stupid audition. I don't know what did I do. I was in the middle of something, something was done. He cast me for Makri, and the person who took the audition was Hani Tehan, who's right now the producer of my current film, which I've just produced, um, Death in the Gulch by Kangana. So yeah, I think it was just uh, accidental, and I think after that. It's been Okay, a fan wants to know when is your short film releasing? Which one? The one I've actually. Zarina Wahab. Wahab ji. No, so that's called the Lovers as of now, and we just shot for it in Gwalior, and Zarina Wahab Nam is playing my mom, and it's a it's a fantastic short film, and it talks about uh, a lot to do with women's right and their right to voice their choice in uh, marriages. So it's a, it's a very Subject and very beautifully shot by Preeti Singh. She's the director, and I don't know when is it going to be out. Now we have to shoot it. We've just shot for it, so I think it will have its own process of you know editing and all that thing that goes on after the shoot to post production. But sooner or later, I'll keep you posted. Okay, Nandini wants to know in Chandra Nandini if you could pick one scene you did that you would relive again because it had a such it's had such an impact on you. Which one would you? Yeah. Wow. Hi, Nandini. <laughs> this is Nandini. <laughs> so, Nandini wants to know which scene would I pick of Nandini being Nandini that I want to tell Nandini. Okay. Uh, I think one scene from Chandra Nandini that I want to relive. I think the most that I enjoyed in Chandra Nandini, although I loved the whole one year of the shoot, but I think Rupa was absolutely amazing, and she was such a weirdo, a complete <laughs> crackpot, and she was right opposite of. What Nandini was, you know, she was so poised and so dignified. But Rupa had long nails, and she used to smoke, and she used to God knows do what. So, uh, if I have to ever shoot again for Chandra Nandini, I would like to, you know, really do so much more with Rupa. And if there's one scene that I want to relive in as Nandini, mm, I think all the horse riding scenes and all the war scenes they were so cool because I mean, बहुत मजा आता था. Salim wants to know: Do you prefer behind the camera or in front of the camera? Oh, that's a tough one, Salim. Hi. Uh, I obviously I love being in front of the camera, and uh, acting has been my passion, and that's something I would obviously would continue doing all my life. But uh, you know, when I um, I uh, did commerce in my plus two, I studied entrepreneurship and business studies, and then I completed my graduation in mass media and journalism. So I discovered behind the camera. और क्योंकि मैं बचपन से काम कर रही थी आई स्टोरीज ऑब्जर्व यू नो द कैमरा एंड हाउ यू नो द एनवायरमेंट एनी प्लेस यू गो आप हमेशा अपने कलीग्स पर आप देखते ही हैं सो व्हेन आई आई हैव मेड अ डॉक्यूमेंट्री आई हैव प्रोड्यूस एंड आई एम प्रोड्यूसिंग समथिंग नाउ सो आई मेड अ शॉर्ट फिल्म एंड देयर इज अ फीचर फिल्म दैट इज कमिंग अप दैट आई एम प्रोड्यूसिंग बट आई थिंक इट्स ऑलवेज इंपॉर्टेंट टू स्ट्राइक अ बैलेंस एज मच एज आई वांट टू एक्ट बट यू नो यू आर नॉट एक्टिंग 12 मंथ्स अ ईयर आई एम नॉट एक्टिंग जैन टू डिसेंबर सो यू नो इन बिटवीन Maybe I can produce or you know do something behind the camera. So I think it's all about uh, striking a balance. Okay, we'll play a quick and fun game with you. You have to hold this. Okay. Okay. Have you done or not? You have to show it to okay. the fans. Okay. Right. I'll ask the question. Okay. Have you ever sang in the shower? <laughs> okay. Have you ever dressed as the opposite sex? Have you ever bought? To, have you ever drunk and driven? Have you ever been on a blind date? And then I went blind. <laughs> you want to share the experience? No, thanks. Not worth it. <laughs> okay. Have you ever had a crush on a teacher? No. Okay. Have
have you ever tasted dog or cat food <laughs> okay have you ever but all all the dogs and cats that i love have all tasted my food so whatever is on my plate is eventually <laughs> they eat it but i never eat pedigree <laughs> so funny okay have you ever failed a class i've always been an average student never 95% but i've never failed have you ever eaten an entire pizza by yourself <laughs> okay have you ever walked out of a movie because it was bad yeah so many <laughs> okay have you ever failed Ill- faked illness to stay home not in school okay that we do okay have you ever cried in public have you ever cried in public never have you ever traveled without a ticket Have you ever lied to your parents about where you were going? Never, because I've had such cool parents. They, in fact, my mother is my best friend. So a lot of times, you know, I would sit at home and watch Netflix, and I would keep reading. And my mother is like, "Are you eighteen year old? Go out with your friends. Party with your friends. What are you doing at home?" So I would never think I could be that. I have to hide something with parents, and I think your parents are your best friends. Yes. If you make them your friends, why should you hide them? आप जब उनको बोल के एंड दे नो द यू नो एंड दे योर पेरेंट्स गिव यू सो मच फ्रीडम टुडे योर पेरेंट्स आर एक्सपोज टू यू नो फेसबुक टू ट्विटर दे नो व्हाट्स गोइंग ऑन एवरीवेयर इन द वर्ल्ड टेल योर पेरेंट्स एवरीथिंग एंड ट्रस्ट मी इफ यू लीव यू नो इफ यू लिव अ लाइफ ऑफ ऑनेस्टी विद योर पेरेंट्स एंड विद योर टीचर्स एंड योर कोलीग्स यू डोंट फील प्रेशर ऑन योर हार्ट एंड यू स्लीप पीसफुली बिकॉज़ यू नो यू हैव नॉट लाइड एंड दैट इज इट्स अ गिफ्ट इफ देयर इज गॉड देयर इज एन ऑनेस्टी Okay, have you ever re-gifted a gift that was given to you? <laughs> Finally, have you ever punched someone? <laughs> yes. In school. It was a fruit punch. In school. Not in school. In school after school before school. Sab jagah pita hai. I've been a total tomboy. So when I was in tenth grade, there was this guy who was teasing a friend of mine, and she was she started crying. So I ran around the entire school. and then he started hiding in the gents toilet so i got into the gents toilet and i hit him brave but i don't encourage you don't do it. <laughs> okay okay now we'll take fans question okay sherlyn wants to know who is your inspiration in life sherlyn hi sherlyn uh, who's my inspiration in life i think i draw inspiration from everyone that i meet because it's not possible that you get inspired from any one person you know True. because all of us have good and bad and you know maybe a lot of things about me you don't like and there's a lot of things about me that you may like and uh, you know every new person that i meet maybe shayad unke habits honge maybe it's you know the breakfast that they eat or the way they hold a pen even mm-hmm. something as small as that is so inspiring to somebody who's achieved achieved you know whatever your parameter of success is so i think uh, i think it's very important to keep your mind open and uh, you know draw inspiration from everybody because i think everybody is capable of teaching you something even if somebody has a bad habit it will teach you not to do it so i think you should uh, just keep your eyes open and just um, you know if somebody is throwing wo bhel puri ka plate outside their car at least you know you should not do it yes so even i think that is a learning experience and maybe you can correct people next time that don't do that just there are so many dustbins they keep complaining that the government is not providing but it's our responsibility Mamta wants to know what motivates you to become an actor. I think what motivates me to become an actor is to live so many lives in one. You know, I can now uh, be a journalist, a doctor, a lawyer, and uh, you know whatever I wish to be. And uh, I travel because of my work. I get to travel a lot. I am um, I'm a very curious person. I love exploring, and I can never do a job which is a job. You know, which is a desk job. And I've done it. I used to work as a script consultant at Phantom Films for a year and a half, and I enjoyed that a lot. But I think as an actor, I can explore so much more, and um, you know, you get to travel, you get to with every team, with every project, you meet new people. You know, Chandranandini, I met some hundred new people because the entire crew was so big. Last in Files, I came to know about fifty hundred more people. So you know, in Indonesia, there's another team that I know. So I know fifteen, twenty more people over there. So I think it just Keep meeting new people. You keep knowing th- new things, new stories, new experiences, 
and yeah your job is to stay fit and look good <laughs> you wear makeup and tongue your hair so why would i be that and be anything else okay neha wants to know who was your first crush who was my first crush my first crush was shahid kapoor okay. i think it was the 90s you know jab wo sare yes. hip hop gaane aate the aur uska ek gaana aata tha shahid kapoor ka aankhon mein tera chehra by aryans i think all of us for the 90s kids remember that song <laughs> and falguni patak songs so i think when i saw that i was like oh my god you know that guy is so cute and we used to call it the puppy song because usme ek puppy bhi tha jo <laughs> so in school we used to all call it the puppy song and uh, yeah that was my first crush in fact trivia i did wala i photo essay only because of that song my parents were dead against me doing wala i photo essay because makri had released and they mm. wanted me to take a break mm. and not you know with all mm-hmm. due respect to a movie with so many kids around but i said mom please what if iske baad mujhe shahid kapoor se kabhi milne ka mauka nahi mila and it's full drama and i convinced my parents that i have Indrani wants to know a theme song for your life. What would be a theme song? Theme song for my life. Yeah. Cheap thrill. Baby, I don't need all the pills to help. I love cheap thrills. Okay, when are you coming to Indonesia? We we are really missing you. Your oh. Indonesian fan page is asking. Thank you. I miss you guys too. Uh, it's uh, we're just figuring out. We're planning. I'll be there soon. It's not. I haven't received all the information details yet, but uh, soon, sometime this month. Okay, we'll take a final message for all your fans who've been here to chat with you and like have spent some time with you. Thank you so much, all of you, for taking out time and being part of this live chat.